tomorrow's school. <laughs> I just got done cleaning my room. Um, I have to take off my makeup. I'm going to do a clay mask. Um, I've been doing it every night because my skin has been bad, but now it's like clearing up because I've been doing this mask every single night. Um, my friend gave me some bentonite clay and I just mix it with apple cider vinegar and it kind of burns and it makes my eyes water but it works so it's worth it. Um, yeah, I'm going to do that and then take a shower. Um, I don't have to wash my hair because I washed it yesterday. So I think it will be okay for tomorrow. Um, and then I have to pick out my outfit. So, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to get the clay. Show it to you guys. It's kind of weird. But, works really well. Um, so I took all my makeup off. And I'm going to do this mask. I keep it in this container just because it's like, it's easier to mix some and then just save the rest for like other days. That way I don't have to mix them every single night because that would be dreadful. Um, the clay is like, it comes as like a powder and then you, or I just added Okay, I'm kind of scared anyways. Um, it's a powder and then I just added some apple cider vinegar to it and then like a little bit of water because um, um, the pH in bentonite clay is very strong so you, you're supposed to add apple cider vinegar to balance it out. Um, I know this one girl that used it she just mixed it with water and put it on her face and she broke out in really painful cystic acne um, because the pH, um, it's just way too strong for your face. So if you buy this, then definitely mix it with apple cider vinegar. The smell is like really strong, but it's it works really well. And also, mm, don't use like a metal container or a metal spoon or anything metal to mix it with. Um, use plastic. Um, or you can use like a wood popsicle stick to mix it. I just use this um, plastic knife because I'm cheap <laughs> and we have, that's what we have so that's what I like to use. Okay, it's like really hard to open. Hold on. It's like not cooperating. Okay, so <laughs> it looks really gross. So this is like what it looks like. It looks really nasty. Um, it just smells like apple cider vinegar really because like, I don't know, I think it overpowers it. If it's only mixed with like water, it doesn't have a smell really, but I really like this stuff. So yeah, I'm going to put it all over my face. And then I will be right back. <laughs> okay, so I put the mask on my face and just like my eyes. I'm not crying. My eyes just are watering. My eyes don't water until I put it on my nose. I don't know if what that has to do with it, but my <laughs> eyes just water when I do this mask. Um, I think because like the smell, like... Um, apple cider vinegar is so strong and so it like makes my eyes water. I don't know what it is. It's the weirdest thing, but um, yeah, I usually leave this on for about 10 minutes, but I need to pick out my outfit for the first day of school. Um, I don't know what I'm going to wear. And Kenya's not texting me back. I think she went to sleep already because it's like 12.30 and she goes to sleep early because she's a grandma. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay. Um, I don't know if I should just be basic and wear like 
a pink shirt and leggings but or if I should actually like wear something I don't know I don't know I have this pink shirt that I got and I really like it it's super cute it has this pocket and then the sleeve super cute I don't know if I should wear that with leggings and my Birkenstocks it's like super basic um I was also oh I was thinking of maybe wearing this varsity jacket with maybe just some black pants and I don't know maybe a plain t-shirt underneath I kind of want to be casual it's, I don't know I like this flannel too um I wore those a lot in Europe so I don't really care for them I don't know I don't know so yeah I'm gonna pick out my outfit and then I'll show you guys what I made a decision on and I probably will change it in the morning anyway so it doesn't matter um yeah I'll be right back so I was scrolling through Pinterest to find like ideas of what to pair with my varsity jacket because like I don't want to do too much because like I don't care I mean I do care but like I don't know I think I'm just gonna pair it with this gray t-shirt I'm not sure how that will look I might end up switching it to a plain white t-shirt let me get this one out I think I'll just pair it with like a plain white shirt or a gray shirt I don't know I'll get them both out to see which one will be best but so I have my varsity jacket and then just black pants and then I don't know if it'll look better with this gray shirt or the white shirt so I guess we'll just see tomorrow when I try it on so yeah that's done I don't know what shoes I'm going to pair it with. Yeah, um, I think it's been about 10 minutes, so I'm going to get in the shower, wash this off my face, and go to bed. So I will see you guys in the morning. Okay, um, I tried my hardest not to get my hair wet in the shower, but my face just feels so refreshed and rejuvenated after using the clay. Um, uh, oh yeah. Oh, let me show you this little. I had this like, I don't know if you can like see it. I had this like pimple that was just super bad right there. And it was like, it was huge like a few days ago. But I've been using this clay mask every single night and it's like, where's it at? Where's it going? It's like shrinking. I didn't even like mess with it or anything. Like anytime I get a pimple, I don't mess with it because I don't want to like scar. Um, but I'm just going to take some witch hazel on a cotton ball and use that on like my problem areas just as like a toner sort of thing. I'm just like hold it there. This helps a lot as well. Um, I noticed that I break out a lot right here, like on my cheeks, because my hair, like I have to use, when it's curly, I have to use a lot of oils and stuff to keep it moisturized, and it touches my face because it's so big. And then it like breaks out my cheeks and stuff. So I like, I wash my pillows a ton. Just so my hair products is, aren't like constantly on my face when I'm sleeping as well. I'm like not tired because I took like a three or four hour nap when I got home from work. So here I am up. And it's 1 a.m. And I have school in the morning. This is great. So actually I think I'm just going to watch Netflix. And... Now I just have to brush my teeth, 
and put my retainer in. Uh, yeah. Good morning. So I just woke up. Um, really tired. Okay. I like stayed up and watched a movie with a friend. That was a bad idea. Okay, so first thing I'm gonna do is just refresh my hair and do my makeup and then I will get dressed. I have like 40 minutes to get ready which is more than enough time so yeah. Oh for my hair I'm just gonna use this spray bottle just to refresh in the curls because it already has enough product in it so I just need to spritz it a little bit with some water and it'll look good as new. Um yeah. Alright, so I just did my makeup. All I do is I fill in my eyebrows a little bit and then I wear mascara and that's it. Um, the mascara I used was the Urban Decay Perversion. Um, it's one of my new favorites. I used to always use the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara. But I used to wear foundation. Well, like BB cream. I was doing that for like a week. I was putting it on every day, but then I started breaking out, and so it's just not my thing, you know? So then I stopped doing that. Okay, I'm going to get dressed, and then I'll show you guys my outfits. Alright, so I am dressed. I just have on this varsity jacket um, that is black and white, and it's super cute. I really like it, and then I have on this gray t-shirt, and I just tied it on the side. And then I just paired it with these black skinny jeans and my bee socks because I'm going to wear um, tennis shoes. So yeah, that's my outfit. Um, it's very cozy and it's like gloomy outside. I don't know if it's going to rain. So I'm just glad that I chose this. So yeah, I'm ready for the first day of school. I just have to get my textbooks and stuff. So let's go. Okay, so I was getting ready to leave and the power went out. Like. This is a great start to the day. <laughs> um, yeah, but I put on my shoes. So I just have on these. Oops, sorry. Um, I just have on these white sneakers. They're like really dirty, but they're still super cute. I guess it just gives them a little bit of character. So yeah, I'm going to go open the garage door. Because now that the power is out, I have to manually, manually open it, which is kind of annoying, but... What's a girl going to do? <laughs> I'm just waiting for Kendra. Oh, wow, girl. Just showing them off, I guess. My textbook, it weighs like a thousand pounds. I'm in calculus too, by the way. And then my purse, which also weighs a thousand pounds. Fun fact, I actually enjoy school. I don't like homework, but I love learning. Like, I just love gaining knowledge, if that makes sense. It's really windy. I don't want to walk to the building. Mm. All right, so I just got out of class. I saw Kenya. Um, yeah, this semester, I feel like it's going to be a good semester. I'm going to actually, like, do all my work and... I'm gonna do good. I have a, I'm gonna be focused, okay? I'm gonna get an A in calculus too. Like, oh, there's a car there. Okay, successful first day. So yeah, thank you guys so so much for watching. Um, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe or don't subscribe. Um, yeah, bye. I wish time. Would hurry up just a little bit so I could spend